Yo, what's up guys? Well, welcome back to another one of my Fortnite videos. In this video, I'm talking about some of the collabs I want to see for the future of Fortnite. So, so some of the guidelines I have are it cannot be a part of any like company that's already in Fortnite. So like Marvel, we can't have anything from like we can't have Cyclops like from X-Men because we already have Marvel skins. So it's going to be like new companies th that we haven't seen in Fortnite yet. And for every single collab that we bring, we have to bring at least one skin, one backling, one pickaxe and one mythic. But I can add as many as I want. It just has to be one of each at least. Now for the first collab I want to see in Fortnite, I want to see anything that has to do with Nintendo, but specifically the Mario franchise or the, the Pokemon franchise. So, so the first one we're going to do is the Mario franchise. So I want Mario and Luigi as the skins. I want a Piranha Plant backbling for Mario and a, a Bill backbling for Luigi. And for the pickaxes, I want a red pipe for Mario and a green pipe for Luigi. Now for the mythics, I, I want a ton of mythics for like each of the powers in the Mario like games. So I want the fire flower mythic and it can like shoot fireballs and it does 40 damage per fireball and it shoots in bursts of three. So the, the fire flower is going to be like the, the, the offensive one, but for, for like a, a defensive one, I want the ice flower. So this one is going to gonna shoot in, it's going to be the same thing as the fire flower, like the, the three shots and everything, but it's going to do 25 damage and it's going to put ice on your, on your enemy's feet every, for like every time you hit them. And for the next power, I want the cat bell from 3D World. So for this power, it's gonna be like an agile to type of power up. So you get it, and you you, you can like bounce off walls and stuff, and like you have like claws, kind of like Wolverines, and you can hit people for like 30 damage per like slice, and has like four animations for the slices, so like kind of like the lightsabers. Now the final power up for the Mario franchise is the tanuki suit so this is gonna kind of work like airbending did in chapter four season ch chapter five season two and you're it's basically gonna have like glider redeploy built into it so if you fall off somewhere you can like glide down and like swoop back up so you're gonna have like flying abilities it's gonna be like wings of icarus as well you can like fly up from the ground you can like glide if, or if you fall it's, it's just gonna be like that now for the pokemon franchise i'm only gonna have one skin it's gonna be Ca ash ketchum obviously and his back lane is gonna be the pokeball which is a very good good choice and if the pokeball is gonna have like uh, all the all the pokemon balls in the game so it's gonna have like for styles of course so it's gonna have like a great ball style an ultra ball style a master ball style and on like the rest of the balls and for the pickaxe, I want I want Geo Dude's hands, and like it it may sound weird, but it's like the only thing I, I could come up with. So if you have any better ideas, then please put it in the comments. But you'd basically like it'd be like Hulk's gloves, and you like just punch stuff with it. And for mythics, I'm gonna have the four fully evolved Kanto starters. So the first one I'm gonna talk about is Charizard. So he would act as like a really strong like NPC that you would hire. So you would throw his Pokeball down, and he would follow you around, he would shoot two attacks, like, he would shoot f a Fire Blast, it's like a big explosion that he would like, throw out his mouth, and Flamethrower, which is like a beam he would like shoot down, and it would like burn everything around. Next up is Squirtle, oh, no, no, Blastoise, because it's fully evolved, and he would shoot Hydro Pump, I think his, his attack name is. And it's like a big beam of water and it would do a ton of damage. And th the second attack he would do is Water Gun, which is like a weaker version of Hydro Pump. Next up is Venusaur. And it, she would basically have like vines that, that she would wh whip people with. That would do like small, like 20 bits of damage. Uh, then her strongest attack would, would, be, would be Leaf Storm, which would do like a ton of damage in just like one big tornado. And the final one I'm talking about is Pikachu, which is it's not going to be a Raichu for this one because you, you can't evolve him when you have him as a starter in the games. So Pikachu, he's going to have Thunder, which would do like a ton of damage. It will like strike down, like, like, kind of like the, the things from Chapter 3 Season 1, like, like the, the Thunderstorms. And his second attack would be Thunderbolt, which would be like a smaller version of Thunder. Now the next franchise I want is One Piece, so we're gonna have four skins for this one. The first skin will be Luffy, and his skin it would have all his gears as the styles, and his backbling would be the gum gum fruit. 
and not every skin in this is gonna have like a pickaxe to go with it the only, only Zora's gonna have it and it, it brings me to my next person which is Zoro so Zoro he's gonna have himself as a skin obviously his back wing would be the things to hold his three swords and his pickaxes would be like come out of the sheaths and he would use his three swords and like I don't know how, how they would like do the animation for that but that's what I want the third skin I want is uh, Nami and her, she would have herself as a skin her back thing would be like the, the map of the one piece world and that's it the final skin for the for the one piece set is usopp and he, he would have himself as a skin and his back thing would be a slingshot and for the mythic i want the gum gum fruit and it would work exactly how it does in the anime so like you could like stretch out really far and like punch people and stuff and you could like jump really high and for the other mythic, I want Zoro's three sword style, and it would work kind of like a, a combination of the, the lightsabers and Leon Leonardo's katanas. Now the next franchise I want is Minecraft, and the skin would be Steve. His backbone would be the golden apple with a with a style for the enchanted golden apple, and his pickaxe would be like all the all the pickaxes. So like you would have a wood pickaxe, a stone pickaxe. A gold pick, like all, all of them would be the pickaxe for like styles. And for the mythic, I want an enchanted diamond sword. Now I know netherite is technically stronger than diamond, but diamond is just iconic to the game of Minecraft, so that's why I want as a mythic. And it would basically work as like a a really slow lightsaber, but it would do like a ton of damage. So, like. Each swing will take like 3 seconds for a swing, but it will do 80 damage per swing. Now the final franchise I want to talk about for this video is Five Nights at Freddy's. Now I want 4 skins for this, which is the main 4 animatronics. So I want Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, and Foxy. But each of those skins would have all of their, their like variation from each of the games. So Freddy would have Withered Freddy, Toy Freddy, uh, Shadow Freddy, and it would be like the same for all of them. You know, but I don't actually think they would do that, but I just think it would be really cool if they did. Now, the back bling for Freddy would be his top hat. The The back bling for Bonnie would be his uh, guitar. The back bling for Chica would be her cupcake. And the back bling for Foxy would be his hook. The pickaxe for Freddy would be his microphone. The pickaxe for Bonnie would be his guitar. And you like take it off his back, uh, kind of like Captain America does with his shield. The pickaxe for Chica would be her cupcake. And she would like take it off her back and like use it as like put it on a plate and like just swing it around. And the bat and the pickaxe for Foxy would be his hook. And he would, he would do the same as the rest, where she would take his hook off his back and like swing it around. Now for the mythic, I had a little bit of trouble thinking of it, but I think these two would be like pretty good cho choices. So the first choice I have would be a jump scare mythic, where you would just jump scare your opponent and it would like stun them for like five seconds. Now the other idea I have is a glam rock Freddy suit and it would work as like a mini Thanos basically. So your shield would increase your for uh, 100, so you'd have uh, 200 shield and 100 health, and you could like claw your opponents for like 20 damage per swing. Now that's all I have for this video, but if you guys would like a part 2 to this, or if you have any suggestions for a part 2, then make sure to leave it in the comments below, and also make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoy the video.